Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today, I have another box from Portland Leather Goods. Look like I'm, I started to buy more Portland Leather Goods again. Hopefully, not too many because I already have a tons of their bags. But they just released this new product called the Toaster. It's basically a large, large size camera bag. And I really want to give it a try because I think this is a great size for everyday use when you don't need to carry a lot of stuff. Let's open it up and take a look. I thought the size should be pretty pretty big but it seems based on this shipping box it's not a very big bag, right? This is open up the box. It has their their thank you card. And then I also got a tassel. They they wrap it like a sausage. Okay, let's just pull it out. So this tassel is their honey color. And it, and this tassel is in their jumbo size. For leather tassel, I tend to prefer get smooth leather instead of pebble leather. I feel like pebble leather the the tassel the, this string kind of this fringe kind of just look weird. But with smooth leather the flow is much nicer. What do you think? Right? Let's put this aside. And here is the bag. So here is the the toaster, their camera bag in honey color. This is making a lot of noise. Let's put it aside. And it has an outside pocket. You can put your phone or whatever tickets or receipts you have. And they have this non-removable strap, but they do kind of give you a quite a long strap. Quite a long strap. I I usually wear my my straps really short, so let it, let's adjust it to a shorter length. And I like that now they have this kind of I don't know what you call it strap strap catcher or strap hook that keep the strap in place so that when you want to adjust it shorter. It doesn't count just flying around. I just really like that. I'll be honest, this toaster is smaller than smaller than I thought. I thought it would be a little bit bigger. But let's take a look inside. So here is the inside. Hopefully you can see. It's very straightforward. It doesn't have lining, but it does have a, another slip pocket for you to kind of organize your stuff a little bit. So, since my Madewell camera bag is just right up on the shelf, so I thought I would pull it up to give it a comparison. So this one, I believe, is the large size from Madewell. And this is a toaster. It's slightly smaller than the made well version. To be honest, the other day I was just thinking that Portland leather good because they are not made in US. Their direct competitor probably is made well because their price range is quite similar in the same similar range. And their product quality I would say is comparable to made well as well. I think the the leather on the Portland leather goods may be slightly better because they do use full grain leather and with made well sometimes I'm not sure what kind of leather they use. They don't really disclose it very clearly I would say. So this is the made well one and this one is the toaster. It's a smaller smaller size camera bag. So if you are you have a smaller frame and you are not as tall Maybe you would like this one from Portland Leather that it won't look too overwhelming for you. So 
This is a great size and I love this leather. It's kind of a really nice neutral brown tone leather that will age nicely. This is the first time I get their honey color. I do like it and in the future when I get some other bag, some maybe bigger totes, I may consider getting this honey color. It's a very good neutral tone for I think for the fall would be so pretty. I know some of you also got a toaster from Portland Leather after they release it. Let me know what do you think about it. Do you like yours? Which color did you get? Thanks for joining me today and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.